Hey, what's up everybody? I'm back again and uh, I'm doing another one of these blog style videos. Um, one of the reasons being that I wasn't able to do another tutorial uh, this weekend because it was my birthday this past weekend. And um, so I was actually taking some time off. So between that and DJing and doing the new stuff with Rolly, uh, it's kind of left me a little bit beat from this past week. And um, so I just decided to take a little bit of a time out. But here I am, uh, and I thought I'd take some time to answer at least one of the questions. So people have been asking me questions based off of my last video. Uh, and um, you know, it's gotten a really positive response. And, uh, and I think that that's really cool. And um, you know, so I don't know if this is something that I'm gonna do weekly. I don't, I don't really get into these type of um, entrepreneurial kind of advice giving type of, uh, type of videos, but I thought that, you know, if people want to know, I'm happy to answer questions. And, um, so one question that, uh, a person asked was just kind of how I got into audio programming and my story. And it's a really long story actually, but, uh, I'll try to give you the short version. So, uh, basically I come from, uh, this is probably like my third or fourth career. I've, I've been in the air force doing counseling. I've, uh, DJ'd all over the world. I've produced music, so um, this is kind of my fourth life, so to speak. And uh, basically, uh, there are a couple layers to the story, but I'll, I'll tell you one. So basically, about three and a half years ago, um, I was basically broke. Uh, so basically, my DJing career, I was I had the fortune of doing a lot of touring around the world, uh, and I've played in like over 25 different countries, but for one reason or another, and I think because, you know, the business and DJing as a, uh, as, as a job changed a lot. Um, you know, basically I was, I didn't have a dollar in my pocket. And so I, uh, and so here I was, I was broke. Um, uh, I didn't have a whole lot of motivation. I was basically sitting and playing video games all day. Um, not really doing a whole lot with my life. And, um, you know, I thought, you know what, I really need to figure it out and get into something else with my life. So, um, luckily, I, I used to be in the Air Force, and uh, and luckily, from the time that I was in the Air Force, there was some um, there was some money that was set aside for me if I ever wanted to go back to university. So it's called the Montgomery GI Bill or the Post 9/11 Bill. And uh, so I thought, okay, there's something else, you know, you know, school is my best option. This is the best thing for me to, um, you know, the best option for me to, to go, to try to do some other career with my life. And so I was looking around and I was Googling things and uh, I think I might have just Googled um, music and computing uh, together because I was looking at stuff like computer networking and stuff like that uh, just thinking I know a little bit about computers and stuff I use them with DJing and producing and you know I never thought about like anything like VST building or anything like that um, and I think I googled music and computing uh, together and uh, I happened to find this program at Goldsmiths it was called music computing now I never in my life until about three years ago thought about doing computer programming. <laughs> um, so I just kind of fell into it. I didn't know if, if, if I was going to be any good at it. Um, you know, but I just thought, you know what, like nothing else is happening. I'm just going to give this a shot. And, um, and it was a tough, you know, three years was a lot of work. Um, because I live outside of London and the journey into university is about two hours each way uh, by train or, or driving. And, um, you know, I just remember three years ago, um, just, you know, waking up at five o'clock in the morning, just getting ready to walk down to the, um, to the bus stop because I didn't even have a car at the time. I couldn't even afford a car. And, um, and just thinking, you know what, like this is the start right here this is like you know this is the start and I'm going to build from from this point everything from now on goes goes up and you know I just made a commitment to really just putting everything that I had into that um, into that program and into building something new for myself and uh, so this 
result that I have, you know, at the moment of, you know, working with Roly and having a great response to the channel that, uh, that I built has really just been like the product of really coming back every day. Um, there's another layer to uh, the question of how I got into programming that I should probably touch on that uh, I think, you know, for me, you know, there's something that kind of had a really big effect on me uh, a few years ago, which is that um, I, I, I once went on uh, to do a tour date in Kenya, in Africa, and, uh, and I DJed in some third world countries before, like India, and Mauritius, and some other places. But there was something about Kenya when I got there that um, when I got there, uh, I'd had the fortune of, uh, of actually being on a TV show there when I got there DJing on TV. And because of that, I had like throughout that whole week that I was there, I had people walking up to me, you know, wanting my autograph, wanting to take pictures with me, which was really amazing. But there was this feeling that I had um, where I really felt like, you know what, like, I can DJ and that's cool and it's really cool to be out here and doing this, but I had this feeling that there was something that I wanted to be able to really kind of give back uh, that was more than music. You know, like I always thought like, okay, you have doctors, you know, like they can actually go out there and they can actually do treatment and they can actually heal people and help people in a tangible way, a, a tangible way meaning that it'll change your life. You know, and, um, you know, the people ask me why I go so kind of full force at programming. Um, and the reason is because I really feel like programming has given me that thing that actually really, that I can kind of help give to other people that helps people be able to change their life or affect their life. You know, and I've had over this past year with the audio programmer with the channel I've had uh, so many people that have that have messaged me and said that you know I've affected their life and that I've inspired them to get into audio programming or you know that they didn't or maybe they wanted to do audio programming but they didn't know the right resources and that I've helped them find the right resources and I think that's like I mean what is better than that what's better than that in the world um, so you know, yeah, that's really affected me. And, uh, you know, so, so I just feel uh, a bit accomplished in the way that, you know, I finally have something that I'm able to kind of give back a little bit. But no, um, <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, you know, I get a little bit emotional, I guess, because, um, you know, it's been a long journey, you know, it's been a long journey. And, uh, you know, I've done a lot of things, but, you know, there's nothing better than that feeling of, like, working so hard at something and, um, you know, and then finally seeing it come back, you know, uh, those five o'clock starts, those two-hour journeys, and then finally seeing it start to come back. And, um, you know, it goes to show, I mean, like I said, I don't want this to be, like, an advice-giving <laughs> type, of, type of channel and stuff, um, you know, unless you want it to be, but... Um, you know, it goes to show that, you know what, sometimes <clears throat> uh, good results don't come quick, you know, things take time, like, you know, you hear a story, you hear a lot of stories about there, out there in media and on Twitter and on Instagram about people that go from like, you know, zero to a hundred thousand dollars a day and <laughs> stuff like that. I'm telling you, you know, it does happen, but what I'm here to tell you is that, you know what, like, for a lot of us, it doesn't happen you know, and that I don't even have a hundred, I don't have a hundred thousand dollars, but you know what, like I can feel something happening and, um, and that, that, and that, you know, sometimes it does take three years of work. Sometimes it takes five years. Sometimes it takes 10 years, you know, but that, you know, if you're at the bottom and you're looking for a quick result, you know, it's not going to come quickly. I can, I can almost promise you that, you know, it's going to take persistence. It's going to take coming back every day it's going to take you know coming back when things aren't working um but i can promise you that if you do come back every day and you do commit to it that um 
you, you should see a positive result if it's the right thing that you're pushing at, you know? Like I've really pushed at DJing and producing for, um, for a long time and, uh, and it really worked for a while. And then there was a point where it just stopped working, you know, it just stopped. And, and I kind of believed this thing that said, uh, this, this, this kind of idea that says, oh, just keep at it and you will succeed. You know what? Sometimes it's not, it's just not right. The, the right idea. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Sometimes it's just not meant to be. And I'm glad that it wasn't for me because I'm a lot happier now that I'm, um, you know, in this career field rather than, um, just DJing and producing music. So, um, so that's my rant for the day or for the week. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, I'm curious to hear your thoughts and, uh, any other questions that you might have technical or otherwise, you know, if you have technical questions, I'm happy to give my best shot at them. Like I said, I'm not an expert, um, but you know, I'm happy to, um, to ask, you know, people in the community and stuff. And, um, so that's where I'm going to end things. And I hope you like this video and I will see you again soon.